don't think I can shell out $200 for one pillow. Oh, that's nice. Call time! To you. We just launched Sunkissed! Issue 3. Yeah, I look crazy because I woke up, got started on work, and launched it. And now we're hungry. And we are gonna get a celebratory lunch at Naya, which is one of my favorite lunch spots in the city when I used to work in the city. And then they opened one in Paramus, and it's closed already. So we just had to make do. We're gonna try to get Jollibee tonight. I'm so excited, I've been craving this. We got a six piece all spicy, two adobo rice, and gravy, and then two fountain drinks. And it was like 25 bucks, 26 bucks. I'm so freaking excited. You gotta hear this crunch. Hopefully you can hear this, it's so crispy. Where are we? This is insane right now. I've never seen this in my That avenue at American Dream. What, this is supposed to be like Rodeo Drive or something? Mark was like, look up where it is, but don't don't look up how to get there. Because he wants to walk. Canada Goose. Anything tickling my fancy at the make your own bag of candy thing because I wanted Swedish candy, but that one's only in the city. So instead, we got something that we've always been wanting to try, which is freeze dried candy. And we got peach rings and airheads. Hopefully, it's good. And I got this like edible bubbles for Zizi because she loves bubbles. This one is cotton candy flavored. I'm gonna try it on Sunday when we see her. I'm so excited! I've been editing the February vlog for like five, six hours now. I'm not even halfway yet. I think I'm making a good move to do weekly because it's a lot. And I'm trying to post it tomorrow. Okay, gotta get back into it. Right there, buddy. I see you on. We're gonna try these. Or do you wanna try it? Yeah, yeah. And then switch. Yeah. I got peach rings and he got airheads. I didn't expect it to feel like that. I wanted it more airy and. Like melt in your mouth? Mm hmm. It's cool. I don't know what white is. I think white's the mystery one. But they never said what it was. Oh, no. you like this better? Mm hmm. It's good, but I'll stick to my gummy candy. Regular peach rings is better. These are better than the regular airheads. Whoa! Because the regular airheads you gotta chew for like 20 minutes. That's true. Who's there? Dry leaves. Oh. <laughs> wow. No. <laughs> it tastes good, huh? It's good. Good try. I, I just had. <laughs> Hi. Got a package. Past month, I feel like I haven't had good sleep and it's because of my pillow. I usually have like a softer pillow that you can just sink into and it was a little too flat. So I thought I would get a new one. And honestly, I wanted to get the Four Seasons pillow they sell it on their website because when I'm sleeping on a Four Seasons bed with their pillows, like instant knockout. I've been in love with their pillows and I did a lot of research on what pillows they use because the one on their website is like $200. So I wanted to get within the same manufacturer, but obviously not the Four Seasons brand. I'm sorry, but I, I don't think I can shell out $200 for one pillow. So I found this Reddit thread of people listing their favorite pillows and there's this redditor that talked about how she found the tag on one of the four seasons pillow and it 
it was this company called Phoenix Down Corporation. He said it feels exactly the same as the Four Seasons pillow. This was half the price. It was like 80 bucks, $85 for one pillow. I know that's still a lot. That's still a lot. I mean, if this doesn't work out, I'd be really sad because that's almost 100 bucks down the drain. But I feel like, I mean, I'll still use it. But yeah, unbox this with me. So I got one standard size pillow. Um, I don't even know what it's called. Soft, it's like they're soft, medium, and firm. And I pick soft because I like flat pillows. Just fall in, but you still have some protection here. So that's what I like. I hope I'm not cutting into it. I know I got some girls that love shopping watching me on here. Get this thing. It's called a slice it's a box cutter but instead of like a blade it uses this i think it's ceramic blade and it's like not sharp at all i mean it's sharp if you like go fast but to the touch it's like not sharp at all and it's so good for opening boxes we've had this one for years now there's a magnet so you just put it on your fridge so it never gets lost it already feels so nice. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> this is what 80 bucks will get you. So extra, I know, but I really, really prioritize my sleep. And that's the one thing, like, if I can't get enough sleep, like, nothing is worth it. This is my treat yourself this month. It's 12, 12 a.m., so it's time for bed, and I'll let you know how it is. Stay winning. Yeah. Happy Monday. Running some errands. We went to H Mart first to grab something to eat. Then we went to BJ's, did some grocery shopping. Now we're going to his parents' house to visit. I just released my February vlog yesterday. It was an 18 minute vlog. That took me over 15 hours to edit, which is insane. Which is why I'm glad I'm gonna do weekly vlogs. <laughs> I'm making an Easter basket for ZZ. There's plenty. It is seven and then we just got back and I did not have my phone the whole time so I'm panicking and just like replying to everyone. Wanted to do a haul because I went on two trips to BJ's last month and I kept forgetting to do a haul. So first things, because I gotta put these away now. Um, steak for dinner this week and maybe next week. Mini cucumbers. I love having these as a snack with tahini. Pasture-raised eggs. And then we got some mini sodas because we're always craving soda. Okay, not always, but like here and there we crave soda and then we reorganize the fridge. We have like a beverage shelf now and it's not looking cute. So we bought some stuff to fill it up with. Chicken strips. Some paper towels, Swiffer, Marta Claritin, trying out this new jerky, barbecue sauce, organic creamy peanut butter, mandarins, five pounds, syrup, pancake and waffle mix, the best coconut water ever, protein balls mix, and all you need is the mix, honey, water, and peanut butter, or any nut butter, and then I got a few things to pack up Allie's birthday gift. Getting ready for Allie's birthday dinner. I'm rushing a little bit because I was doing something before this. I'm gonna try to put lashes on. Let's see if I can do this in 15 minutes. I know that seems like a lot of time, but for me, that might be just enough or not enough. <laughs> 
fill in the gap, and then bottom washes. Uh, I think you could have done better. Ollie, you're... Yeah, I think that's what it is. Whoa! Oh, there we go. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Whatever you're now, most from on that card, I feel that too, okay? Not the Prada. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They look so good. Hi. Where's your toy? Hi, buddy. Cool toy, come here, your tail. <laughs> They're so fat. Ah! We went to Whole Foods after our walk. Call time. Chicken thighs on sale. I got a papaya. I didn't have to sit out for a couple days, honestly. An heirloom tomato because I love eating tomatoes with cracked sea salt as a snack. Bananas. Mark's gonna make banana pudding. Strawberries. Edamame. Frozen broccoli. Whipping cream for the banana pudding. I wanted to try the Doc Pop, which is Dr. Pepper and this strawberry lemon soups from the bar. This one is the clam chowder and this is the coconut curry with chicken. Small but good haul. Say bye to the vlog. Thanks for watching. What's this? You're coming out of the locker room going to the NBA?